it's Amy and today I'm going to talk about my top 14 favorite blushes. I wanted to do this as top 10 but unfortunately I couldn't eliminate anything so yeah anyways that's that. So I'm going to do it by brand and obviously it's probably no surprise um, my favorites of course are my NARS blushes and I will just start and no these are not in order of how I like them or anything like that. The first one is Desour, and it's kind of difficult to swatch this. Okay, that is right there. You know what? Let me make it a little bit brighter. Okay, hopefully that helped. That's right there. It looks dirty almost <laughs> in swatch form, but it is so pretty. It is, this is like my favorite blush color. Not necessarily Dussor, but like that kind of tone. Like that sort of brownie pink. I think it looks stunning on a lot of people's cheeks. I think that's like a really safe blush. So, or a safe sort of color. The next one's Orgasm, which um, I love, and I think most people love. Um, as I've said in my NARS blush video, NARS blushes are made to be, um, are made for women of all, people of all um, shades and tones, and so, oh, that's right there. Um, so it's really meant for everyone. <laughs> And everyone can wear um, nose blushes and look great, but um, for some reason, some people say they don't like the way that orgasm looks on them personally. But it's one of my favorites. Um, it's just a really easy blush to wear any time of year. And people talk about it being too glittery, but I find the glitter to be more like a shimmer and just to really give your face um, light and life. So I don't think that's a bad thing, but some people do, so... And the next is Dolce Vita. And this is a beautiful blush um, for ladies that are um, darker complected. But I also love it um, on very pale cheeks. Um, and that's right there. And that one, um, obviously I just use, that's that really heavy swatch. But I just use um, a very light hand. And that can be a beautiful blush. Um, I like it in winter a lot around Christmas. Although I don't follow like those kind of rules of makeup like wear X color in X season and whatever. I just wear what I feel like wearing. Um, and then Penny Lane. This is my favorite cream blush by any brand. And it looks like that. It's so pretty. I don't know. It's hard to see. But... Maybe put it here. Can you see that? It's another one of those sort of dirty pink colors. It's gorgeous. I love to layer that one. Penny Lane is a blush I think that can be worn by everyone again. It's just really universally flattering. And then people that don't like orgasm typically like the color Deep um, Throat which is this one, and I like both. I am definitely a fan of both colors. Um, the Deep Throat is more pink. You can see that there, and in comparison, Orgasm is like there, okay. So yeah, they are quite different. Um, a lot of people say if Orgasm doesn't work on your skin type, um, deep throat might. Um, I like them both. I think I think there's definitely a reason to have both. Um, and then Gaiety blush. This is um, such a beauty. It's an absolute stunning blush. It's obviously very blue toned pink and very very bright. But again, with a light hand, it's just gorgeous. I should have done this when there was natural light, but I wasn't home. 
Um, and then, okay, so that's all for my NARS faves. So, yeah. Um, next, I have two MAC favorites, and the first is Blush Baby. I love this. <laughs> it looks so boring, and you're probably like, why in the world would you like that? But, um, again, it's that dirty pink, and I just think it looks amazing on the cheeks. So, it's right there. And a lot of my favorites are looking the same. And then my favorite MAC cream blush is Posey. Looks like that. And you can apply these with your finger or with a brush. Um, I prefer finger. Now that is obviously a very heavy swatch. You wouldn't actually wear it like that, but... Um, and then I have one of my very new favorites, which is like fastly becoming like a serious favorite of mine, is Nude by Dolce & Gabbana. And this one was highly recommended on YouTube from a lot of different people, and obviously I can see why. First of all, like these blushes, or this blush in particular, is so soft and easy to work with. And it is, I don't even know that you can see it, but it is a gorgeous, gorgeous blush. Okay, and then I have one favorite by Inglot. It's 92. And it looks like this. And it is like a purpley. And I remember when I got this one, I wore it all the time. It kind of reminds me of like, um, what is the eyeshadow from MAC? Satellite Dream or Hepcat. Like, look at that. So pretty. I don't really have places to swatch left, so, um, oh, maybe right here. Yeah, right there. So pretty. Um, and then... Just a few more, guys. Hot Mama by The Bomb. This is one um, that I have had twice because <laughs> I had it, and then I thought, mm, I don't really wear it. It's a lot like orgasm. I don't need to. And then <laughs> I got it again. So pretty. And it's not like orgasm. I mean, it is in a way, in the glowy way, but it you could definitely um, justify having both. It's so pretty. And then by Illamasqua. Um, Kiss, no, not Kiss, Katie, sorry. Um, I also have that Illamasqua blush collection somewhere on my channel if you are interested. I love this. It is a baby pink, a blue base pink. It's gorgeous. I like to layer that one. And then one of the Tarte um, clay blushes, Amazonian clay, in Adored. I don't hear that this is that many people's favorites. Not sure why. I love it. Oh, it's that one. It comes up almost like with purple hues in it. And there's sparkle in it. I just love that. And then, lastly, Dior. And it's the Dior Bronze Harmony to Blush. Um... And I like 001 Rose Brasilia. Okay. <laughs> so when I show you this, you're going to not get it. Because I didn't get it when I saw it. I was like, what? That's what it looks like. And it looks like, what in the world? Like, who would wear that and why? And But when you swirl these colors, I am telling you. Let's see. Um... It's so pretty. Okay. Is that a good swatch? It's hard. Oh, it's so hard to see. I'm sorry, guys. Let's see. Maybe. Um, here, I'll put this. Okay. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that. <laughs> it's just so pretty. And it's like bronzy. It's gorgeous in the summer. I know I said already I don't 
you know, stick to those kind of summer, winter rules. But um, I really do like this one in the summer, but I like it all the time. But anyways, I think it's gorgeous, and I think it's overlooked, and um, probably not that popular. It seems like the one that's really popular with Dior is that, um, it's that really pretty pink one that um, supposedly adjusts to your skin type, or your skin, your skin, um... I don't know how it adjusts to your skin, but somehow it does. I don't have that one yet. Um, so, anyway, but this is these are my faves, and if you have any questions, let me know. I am going to show all my blushes eventually. Um, I want to do my MAC blushes, a video on that, and then a video on, like, all the other blushes that I never showed. So, um, yeah. Okay, hope you guys are well. Bye.